Hi, this is Lee. Uh, today we're talking about uh, one sesame one. This one I just received uh, a few days ago. And this is come from the reward. So uh, I, I received the reward and then like 180 something. And then I can uh, switch for uh, any kind of eyeshadow or any kind of product I choice for the amount. So I got a three colors uh, because I want to do the eyeshadow today. So I got a three color. One is purple, one is orange, one is uh, uh, chocolate colors. Okay. Uh, so for right now, and uh, we use the setting powders. Okay. I love these uh, setting powders. They uh, make you everything perfect, just uh, cheaper and then uh, easy use. And then you can use whole face, sun area, you know. Uh, this one is from the. Mm, it's from the uh, Chiku Halo uh, brush. It's from the Japan and T6. That's very very good to use you can use uh, you know whole eyelid and then you can use for the bronzer see it's very easy to use you know, you know they can do its ugly area you want so that is very good the uh, uh, little brush also you know you can do like this that's very good brush okay and then we're starting right now and first things I like to put the uh, orange color, orange tone for first. Okay, orange tone, let me see which brush we use. Then we use the Tom for Tom for this uh, number 11. Tom for number 11, they uh, flat like that, you know, little flat. So you can use it for like a whole eyelid, you know. Okay. Then we uh, take some first. Let's see. Oh, okay. I prefer just you know take a little bit extra off, and why not starting to? Yes, baby. Yeah, I'm happy. Thank you. <laughs> okay, and other side. This brush only thing is uh, I feel they make a very even job, you know. So when you put that, they very even. Okay. So then we finish the orange first. And then why now I want to try to the purple. Purple. Let me see where we put the purple. I can say I may put the uh, chocolate color right here, so may purple color right in front. Let me see how how it work. They also come with one a uh, very a little um you know little tiny brush on here. Uh, maybe I can try there for the tiny brush. Let me see. I don't know. Can you see that? Mm, I try. Because uh, my husband just make a uh, new camera for me, uh, so I just, I just uh, not sure it's uh, okay for you guys to see very clear, you know. Sometimes when we do the makeup, usually it's for happy, for fun. So you know, so don't just uh, too afraid to try some color you never tried before. But sometimes you know you never know, right? Like summertime, you will be have a lot of hmm, kind of pretty, right? Oh man! Oh man! Oh yeah! You don't like it? <laughs> My kids say, "Oh man!" <laughs> okay. All right. I feel that purple is pretty okay to next to the orange. I don't feel like a very agua to look. Okay, then we try the chocolate one, okay? Let we see. 
Or same thing, chalky one inside, they have one little brush. And then they, oh my god, the color is very pretty. I think last time I already uh, text the, uh, the, the chalky color one already. Okay, then we see, I like to use the um, Chiku Holo uh, GSN OA brush, that one. You can see the that one the the front the tip have a little bit the uh, you know look like like this wrong and then have a tip on the front so every time when I do that is I use tip right here they already make an ingo come out so you know you don't need to do that you know so they they blending very well also because the brush is very soft and then we do the other side. Okay, same thing, you need to pull like that way, you know, go inside, so. Come on closer by, little more. You okay? You okay, Ping Ping? Okay, I need a more, okay? The chocolate color is good. You know that brush is good because uh, I have very sensitive uh, eyelid, and then you know if sometimes the brush not soft, and then I will feel a uh, little hurt of my eyelid, and then kind of itching. But this brush wish me almost. Uh, I don't know. But this is more than a five year, that's for sure. See, they still looks brand new, very good. I don't see they have hair loss or anything, you know. But you can see a lot of different. And then for when I have eyeshadow and then no eyeshadow for the eyes, right? That is, mm, that's good. That's good. And also you can see they uh, looks very natural. But every time when I finish that, I will getting one uh, clean brush and to make sure I have two of them uh, round brush. They kind of uh, similar. This one is uh, Tom Four number thirteen. You see, and this one, you know, you that is that two is very very similar. You see, very very similar. Really look same. But just that one is Chiku Holo GSN10. You know, you just, they both is very, uh, I think Tom Fu one little more hair and the Chiku Holo one just like more uh, open little bit. So I think that one is for sometimes uh, you want to blend in or this one sometimes you still can for eyeshadow dip and then blend. But if for, for the cleaning, the brush and then uh, make the eyeshadow even. I feel that one is more better. Uh, but that one only for uh, when you want a blending uh, even uh, more pretty natural look. So use that one better. But if you want to just only use one brush, Tang Fu one is a good choice also, you know, because that one I try to uh, make eyeshadow uh, on there. But they make eyeshadow too fly. They mean, uh, they they will go sunspot. It's not uh, what we want, you know, because it's a round brush. So, uh, definitely you you will understand it, you know. So round brush, I feel when we do that, uh, for clean we uh, clean we uh, eyeshadow uh, one day, blending very well. That's better choice. You see that right now. That is very good job. And this one, so when sometimes I like to do the like eyeshadow dip first and then put right here and then bring, 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 bring everything in and left over a little bit and I do that. So, you know, depend what we what you guys need, you know. So this is a two wonderful brush. But this one uh, for blending, very soft, 
very good job. But if they pick out the eyeshadow, uh, not not like a, uh, you know, not like a every brush, you know, they they do their own job. They know which spot you need to go to or something like that. Next video, I will be making all of my all of my uh, Chiku Holo brush or Tom Ford brush, anything brush or uh, how they use and then which one uh, better for which area. I may I may do whole brush video next time, but today we just do the eyeshadow. So whatever I use today, I just show you uh, what brush I use. Okay, for right now. Okay, so no, now you can see that, right? Left and right. And they do really good job with the needle brush. Of course, I have uh, other needle brush also, so I will let you know. And then, but this one is my favorite one, and it's easy to use on the top eyelid. So you know, I just okay. So this one, this brush is uh, Chiku Holo. Uh, GSM 11 and yeah, let's see. Okay, the, the, the front like this. You know, it's, it's very easy to use. Sometimes you can use it on a corner, you know, like this corner. You know, they do very good job. Very, very good job. Okay, so why now? Uh, I want to use one type more tiny brush. This is from the uh, number. 08 uh it's from the i think it's from oh from the way glass or something like that mm, it's a spare like a w a y n e g o s s this uh complete day brush is very soft also and they do pretty very good job you see how tiny i don't know do they still sell that brush but because this one is i buy very long times so i use very long baby baby you can make make a video right now okay come on you say hi come on come on here you see you say hi say hello <laughs> this is my baby chingy okay chingy the sesame uh number eight they call the diamond block this one I saw you guys video last time also. It's very easy use and then um, easy and fast. They have little uh, shiny spangle inside. Uh, I don't know if someone like it and it's, it's pretty good and then pretty. Uh, but if you don't like a spangly, they have matte black. I think they have a uh, thick matte black right there, so they don't have any spangle or anything. But sometimes I like to do a little bit of shiny eye look, so this one uh, not bother me. You see the difference? I feel mm, it's very easy and fast, you know. So for this one, why I saw you the needle brush before? Because like this, I can give it on there. But the bottom one, okay, the bottom one here, I don't use the whole uh, pencil to do that because uh, the the front is not a uh, you know not like a tip like this, you know, so. I don't want like a too big on the bottom, so I always use the tiny brush and to give some, and then I put on the bottom. Okay, and here also. Okay. You know, when you do the eyeliner, you don't need to do all the eye, you know, because they look like uh, too much. Depend your eye shade also, you know. Mm. I just like to put a quarter of the front here, and then here to connect it, and then to open my eyes because my eyes front 
like a needle low lower so i need to make it there and make a needle wrong and looks like uh looks like soft you know not 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 like a uh uh, angry tire face you know but i think it's because of my chip because of my chip so sometimes i feel feel sometimes i don't smile and then <laughs> looks like i'm a mad you know <sighs> but sometimes it feels like that and then you have no way changes on you only way to do is you use the makeup and to to help your face lose lose soft you know okay so why not uh we finish the eyes we think it that uh, is not you think about that is pretty or mm, yeah i feel that looks a very natural look and then i kind of like it you know it's very good the completion to see the orange on the all all lip and then the purple on the front and the chocolate on the back and then black diamond for the eyelid and top and then bottom quarters mm. I feel we make out like this and then you know I showed oh, that was pretty good already you know but I still have some uh, blue and brown last time I purchased and you know this is very good uh, pencil also but I'm, I I will not put on today because I feel they're gonna be too much you know okay so uh, why not we do add a little bit this one's from the uh, cuter pole uh, number one and number two and it's for I like also uh, I use the number two I like a natural uh, uh, I like I, I like this you know so uh, I don't like it too looks like a too broad or something like that it's a, this this uh, is a very skinning uh, brush on the tip you know for each side yes they just like a coffee kind of and then soft somewhere you need and make your eyes look good and also this one like a, that longer tip side and sometimes i like it to refill my eyebrow you know like this and some feeling because some some eyebrow i don't uh, have very much some areas so i sometimes i do like just add a couple line on there and to lose like a natural you know so when sometimes uh, you do like a, a feeling uh, have some heavy you put too heavy you can use the brush like a clean brush you know to do like this make your hair up see they will lose natural and then not too much you know okay we can't we, we go too far again <laughs> sometimes i always like to talk this and then maybe i go out of sight i'm sorry and why not we use the uh flash okay okay This is from the cuter pole uh, uh, lash clip and then that is very good also uh, they match my uh, eye shape so they don't uh, they don't hurt me or anything make me not cannibal or pull my uh, lash off or something like that no they don't and then also a shishito one is uh, very good also uh, I always come come uh, completion to use that. So when I finish that one, and I will use that because they have a little bit the uh, uh, streak, you know, like a little bit open streak. So other one I is my eye shape, and this one is like a little bit of streak, and they make the the uh, eyelash a little bit uh, uh, open, you know, like like up out a little bit. Okay, and for right now and then we can one more item i want to show you and uh, this one is from the uh lash stuff and this is uh, for uh usb uh oh, i'm sorry the usb uh, charger on the back so when you out of power you can charge it
Okay, so when you hold on, and this is like uh, have light on there, the green, so uh, that means you be ready to go to use, and the this one gonna be have a little bit uh, warm heat on there, but they're not gonna be bother our, our, our eye. So, yeah, when you use that, you can feel a little warm on there. And this one good for sometimes you know some uh, area uh, we cannot reach or something like that you know that's very good to use it you know okay so this can use the bottom knife also When you use that, and then you can feel a little warmer on your eye. Yeah, that's no more. Why I not use that? Because I feel when I did that, and then they, uh, my lash is falling down very easy. You know, I use after and then change my life, and that is even why now still is my flavor, flavor one. But this one have one thing is, they they don't have like a, like a, some people if you wanna like a, uh. To say smoking eyes want to look like a lot lash, and you know, they not they just make you lash and let your look and natural let your look, you know, you know what I mean, just like a um, original uh, lash, and then they help you holding up and shake very well up and not falling up, falling down, you know. I like to use on the, my uh, ba bottom eyelash. Mm -hmm. They use very little, and then sometimes if you know outside have flow or raining, yeah. they not make my uh, bottom eye eye eyelid have is like a panda, you know, have like a black. No, mm -hmm. they waterproof also, uh, doing very 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 good job. This one I can guarantee, and then you guys will be love it. But if you you wanna uh you you want a very volume look, you can on the top of the other uh, mascara you like, you know. So like this for the bottom. And so right now I add a sesame. That one is a very good uh, product, and I don't try the other brush tip yet. But this one is only I try is on a small tip on the front, the little brush, and then I add a, on the top of the cuticle one. And this one because they have more volume look, so make my uh. Make my eyelash a uh, little more look like I have m more uh, hair. You see that? But uh, if I only use that one, sometimes you know they make my uh, lash falling down because I my uh, eyelash is like uh, thicker and then. Uh, too strong, so sometimes you know not easy for uh, stay up all the day long. So I need to use two uh, mascara. If you like, uh, if you have same problem uh, like me, you you will thanks to me and you were very happy. You know, you are very happy. You you do the combination and then you don't need to worry. You know, like a half day later and then you make up and uh, lash just falling down cover your eyes you know and they just stay all day long and then for a long times I always 
always like that. Okay, so right now, if you have sun spa, you see that have brush, just use the clean brush and then to clean the top and the bottom. Don't just use the hand to wipe it, you know. They very easy to come off. They don't bother you. All right, thank you for watching and this is today's video and for eye look. And then if you guys like it and then uh, uh, just next you can leave the message let me know or, or any kind of product any kind of brush you want to know and then you can uh, leave it down below and then i can uh, find the number and find the name for you all right uh hope you in and we'll see you next time okay bye